Welcome everybody. So oh, gotta pull over here quick. Hello. Button in the combine. Guys, it's time to sell the combine. Um so basically guys what's happening is you're probably really confused, but it's March now. Um getting ready for planting season again already. It's now the early 2000s, and, um, did some hard thinking, and, uh, guys, well, this year, oh, wow, dealership got some new stuff in, but, guys, I was thinking this year, we're selling our, old, our oldest combine, um, and, uh, well, we're selling it and we're picking up a new one. So you already know what we have to do. And I decided we're only gonna buy a new combine this year. We're not getting a new tractor or anything like that. Just because we're gonna save up some money this year. And um next year we're going to uh We're going to work on it this year. This summer, we're going to work on tilling and uh, getting a new field down. But I'm also thinking that we should probably... I was doing some more thinking, guys. And, uh, well, our farm, it's been growing. So, I've been thinking... Now that we're getting, that there's some big equipment out there, like, I was checking out, did check it out the other day, like, this combine right here, we could get some big fields going, and we could be making a lot of money if we sold the farm that we have now, and just bought a new farm, like, somewhere else, like, maybe over in Iowa or something, but we could make a lot of money doing farming up there. With the corn farming around here, we're just... We're just not making enough. But after this year, I think we're gonna save up, because we got 772,000. I think we'll save up and buy a new farm. But, uh, I did already pre-order that combine right there, and that header. I, uh, bought it. I'm not sure if it's this exact one, or they're pulling it up, but we're in the 2000s, and they got these new computer thingies, so they might be pulling it up on these, alright, so you want me over here? Okay, so I'm just popping on this, oh wow, you guys have like everything set up over here. Oh, park over here. Okay, so this one. You have to like click on the button. There we go. Alright, so. We were supposed to have pre ordered. Uh, where is it? This combine right here. $288, right? And we had the extension on it. There we go. That's what we were supposed to have ordered. That was $176,000. It says buy. I guess I'll just buy it there. Oh, that, that's how you do it then. I'm not used to this new technology stuff right here. Then we had our corn header. Which one did we have? Yeah, that's, that's the header we had. 
Yep. Okay, so fill that out. Okay, so that so they're bringing it around now. Yep. Uh, okay. So it should be. Okay, so it'll be here. All right. Well, they they brought a combine over. All right. Hop in it. Fire it up. Oh, ho. nice fresh new combines now. Got a header. Zoom it right up on the trailer. Oh, that did not work. Okay, that's. And there we go. Oh, we're off. Yeah, that's the reason we kind of bought a, a bigger truck. Is because hauling equipment like this. I, I knew we were going to need something bigger. And I think we might need an even bigger truck than this. Uh, it's pulling it, but... Uh, we better we better lower Good thing about that uh, gooseneck fifth wheel or whatever tailgate is because we can lower this all the way. That way it's not wobbly. Oh no. Put the straps down. That way it doesn't fly off. Alright. There we go. We have uh, picked up. A brand new combine for the uh, farm. All right, it's nice. Okay, drop that there. All right, well, we got a self new combine. Alright, we're gonna park the truck here. It's nice on this farm. It's because it's small and we don't need to have a semi. But the other thing is, we don't make much. With this equipment, like this combine, we could be making so much more money. Yeah, I think we're selling the farm next year. We did have a guy come down, put some lime, and I think we are gonna sell this farm. Just because we have so much, we could be making so much more money. We have like perfect equipment. We have perfect amount of equipment to be making more money. So I think we're gonna sell the farm next year. Alright, up the international. Now the international here, this tractor, it's also getting pretty old. Come back here, we're gonna hook up to the disc. It's pretty old. With this disc, I only got this disc what last year, I think, so we don't need to replace this. This disc is still on the market. They're still selling it. Yeah, I was thinking actually about getting a couple more of these discs. But that'd be if we bought a bigger farm. If we keep this farm, I'll probably buy one more disc. But if we do sell it, I'm, I'm gonna buy a couple more. For the next... Well, I'll probably buy like one more disc if we keep this farm. If we don't keep the farm, I'll buy like two or three more discs. Alright, well, 
I am uh, gonna let my friend do that. And uh, guys, this is the end of the video. Hopefully you did enjoy. Picked up a brand new case now. It's not international anymore. It's case. Picked up a brand new case combine. And uh, we sold the old John Deere one. So, yeah, the next one we will be replacing will probably be this hydrostatic one. But I do like it because it is a nice little small combine. But, yeah, so hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Um, I'm, I, uh, am reading suggestions, so please suggest down below on my videos, guys. Um, and please help me find, guys, I need help finding a good farm map. I want to find another map, because this map only has, no joke, this one little field on this entire No Man's Land map. And the No Man's Land map is a great map, guys. I love it. It's just, we need a map that we have some newer 2000 stuff where it's not all like forests like this map is. We need a map that's, um, we're able to do uh, more of it on. Okay, guys, I'm not joking. I did not put this dirt bike here. And the dirt bike. When it's poked, it's always upright. Okay, it is. Alright. Okay, this is the end of the video, guys. Hopefully, you'd enjoy. I picked up a new combine we'll play, and uh, I'm just gonna up the fields. I'm gonna do it off camera just because it'll take forever. But yeah, that's the end of the video, so I'll see you guys later.